batteries this month. I've got flyers. Are you going to perform with us next month? How y'all doing? Bye. Uh, Ricky Hood here, and I can tell you a little bit about myself. Uh, I'm from Charlotte, North Carolina. That's what I was saying. I'm from Uh Been here now almost eight years. Uh, transplanted here late in life. I came up here when I was 48, now I'm 55. Oh, Six. he's such an old man. <laughs> and yeah, my dye, my, the dye in my beard is going out, so it's going back to gray. <laughs> um, and I do have a book. I wrote this book, uh, In Due Season. It's a collection of poems and essays. Um, you bought a copy last time I was here. I hope, yeah, you bought two. I hope you like what you read. I sure did. Um, and so I have some for sale if anybody's interested, but I also have some new work I want to share. And also, um, last time we were here, we, uh, Joy gave us um, a, con uh, what was that? Um, a challenge. A challenge. Yes. <laughs> and she gave us some random words and to see what we can do with those random words. Yes. Uh, and I'm going to start off with that. Okay. Now, is this the list that you're speaking of? Yeah. No. The, the oh, you had the long list. list. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So, you got serious. And I got a lot of those words. I'm sorry. <laughs> I had to scratch. I had to check off each word that I used. Um, but um, but this, is the, this is the poem that I got from the challenge. And it's called Justice for Some. I anticipate on the night of the next full moon, the sky will collapse. The pillars holding it aloft will buckle under the tension of supporting such a high, inexhaustible myth that justice is blind. To say that her, object, her objectiveness disappeared is to believe that she at one time was objective, uncompromised, or fair and blind as she should be. Jim Crow and Justice was once married. <laughs> so in love, she gave him everything he wanted, from water fountains to bathrooms, to giving five-year prison sentences to black men for rape he didn't commit, to three months in jail for white men who pled guilty and found guilty for the same crime. American justice is not blind. She has not divorced herself from Jim Crow, though he has gone into hiding. All right. I'm loving it. Now, the, um, what I was hoping I could do was to find the list so that I could share them because uh, that was incredible what you just did. I mean, I have a, a shorter list of words that anyone that would like to accept the challenge can, can take that for this next month to come and share but i'm going to bring the list next month and if you could bring that again because i want them to be able to yeah, and i hate, hate to say that was a good challenge for me because i haven't written a poem you really, really sit down to write a poem is sometimes inspirational and you just do it right and sometimes you have to sit down and just grind it out right and i haven't written a poem in months tell you the truth maybe since the beginning of the year and so that challenge gave me the opportunity to sit down and really just graft out a poem and and i do appreciate they got the juices running well that's the fun of this exercise i'm going to pass this around just take one and pass one um this is a shorter list Matter of fact, this might be something that you could have fun with too, with some of your classmates. Um, take one, and give one to a friend. Let's see, do we have? But this is something that uh, we poets we find all types of things to do with words, and so this is one where you can simply pick a list and create a poem from using the words in the list. And the more the the tighter you make it, in other words, the less other words that you use, the more creative you can be with the poem. It's, I mean, you can get a very, very long poem and just use these words, or you can get a really tight poem and use these. It's the tight poem, really. That's the one. I'm sorry. <laughs> 
Which one is Paul? Isn't that pleasant? <laughs> Thank you very much. That was pretty good. Thank you very much. Oh, yes, yes, yes. yes. Um, name of the stone, name of this poem is Stones. Um, I wrote this back in the 90s. Uh, I don't know what year I wrote, but it, it wasn't in this century. <laughs> How about that? Uh, but stones. Stones. Rough, sharp from quarries deep. Cold, like okay, a black, cool from slopes steep. With diamonds, gems, emeralds, rubies, smooth, polished like privileged babies. Stones of beauty, shiny, hard, rough and sharp at its start. Words, like stones, how similar they be to hurt, maim, and kill beautifully. Mm. Wow. So words do hurt. Oh, you said beautifully. I love that ending. I love that ending. Um, and I'm going to read just, a, just from, a, from a book. And hope you like it. This is called Sugar Daddy. Uh -oh. <laughs> hey, brown sugar, come over here and get your sweet daddy some kissing. That man you got can't handle hot love. He don't know what you're missing. <laughs> that gal, Mary Jane, can hold a liking to you, so I tell her to go on the way. Y'all, it's just a sassy, sexy, walking, talking thing. Hot, bubbling brown sugar on my doorstep all day. <laughs> See her on my left, honey? Nah, you don't have to get up. You can stay all day with your hand in my pocket playing with my wallet that way. <laughs> your man ain't got what I got, and I know you understand. I don't mind you being married, being faithful to your man. But my wallet's always here for you when you need a hand, because you're my sweet brown sugar, and you're my, and I'm your sugar daddy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and just this one last one. Um, I think I'll just go ahead and read Moments in Time. And this is just a love poem. And I hope you like it. Moments in Time. In all the days made to years, none have lived, none have lived as the likes of you. Moment and moment dance in time, moving steadily. In all the hours used in days, and never enough, never enough hours exist that we may dance always, always moving steadily. And all the seconds pass into hours, nearer to you, nearer to you I come, dancing in time moving step and all the moments moving in time to need one more moment one more moment is never enough time to love you dancing always always together moving step all right thank you it's only ten dollars only ten dollars <laughs> Christian. <laughs>